All right, let's do our two minute men DraftKings lineup. Uh, we've actually Woo. let's recap. Let's do that. Last week's lineup, we had Luke List, the winner, Will Zalatoris, runner up, John Rahm, who I think finished. What did he end up finishing third? Mm -hmm. Was he third? And then uh, a slew of made cuts, but just not great finishes. Joseph Bramlett, who crapped out over the weekend. Wyndham Clark and Francesco Molinari, who crapped out over the weekend. But how about us? A six of six. Six of six. When last week, I think there was like an eight, eight to 10% six of six ratio or whatever. Six of six for the two minute men last week. Pat on the back. Good for us. I think that lineup would have done pretty good. I don't know what the total would have been, but uh, that lineup, you would have cashed with that lineup. Yeah, I'm sure. So. Yeah. All right. Um, all right, let's get ready to build here. I got to get my thing going here. Oh, nope. I need to do it over here. All right, we got the clock up. Two minutes. Clock is up. Two minutes. This is going to be an ugly lineup, people. Remember, we're building this lineup to thinking of it as a, a larger GPP. Yeah. And we're trying to fin finish in the top 1% of lineups. That's it. We, if we finish in the top 20%, and we we double our money. We don't care. F that. That's not what we're here for. We're here to take it down. All right. So that's the that's the thought going into this. All right. I am ready. Whenever you start the clock, I'm running the DraftKings thing. Pat, you can start us. Or Sam, go ahead. Producer Sam, start. Here we go. Oh, can I interest you in Lucas Glover at 7,800? God no. Why would you do that right off the bat? I can't okay. Do. Well, I'm just trying to make this interesting. All right, we'll go, let's go up to the top. Burger. Okay. Yes. Last year's champion. Yes. All right, so let's go Burger. Um, Strillman. We both agreed on Strillman. He'll be high end. That's okay. We'll make up for it. All right, let's go Strillman. How about... Um, Ugh, this is so nasty. I kind of talked myself into Putnam after what's his name. In well, the chat. Why don't we do Putnam? I actually think that might be after, an interesting play. Yeah, after Robbie, yeah, talked him up in the chat. I kind of uh, Nick Taylor. Could I interest you in a thirty fourth place? No, no, for Nick seven, Taylor. Seventy three hundred, thirty fourth. Mm -mm. Nope. Jeez, Naismith. I feel like Naismith's going to be talked up so much this week. That it's gonna hey, be... what about what about JJ Spawn? I'll go Spawn, even though I talk crap about him. <laughs> Okay. All right. All right. So that leaves us with seventy nine hundred. Yeah, forty nine seconds left. Um, could I interest you in? I don't like any of the AK guys. So we either need to like pound a a nine K person here, and stack up. Let's let's go up to nine K. And Ooh. how about? Hurry, Kiz. I don't like it. I don't Tringali. like it. I'll I'll do Kiz. That leaves us with sixty eight hundred. Uh, I don't like this lineup. Uh, Eckroat. No. Ah. Smotherman. Hubbard. Hubbard. Smotherman. Ah. No, I don't like that either. I hate this lineup. I, I would like go, lineup. I would go Hubbard. All right, Hubbard. Done. Seven seconds left. I, I hate this lineup. This lineup is so bad. But we, you just said it before we started it that you got to, you were going to hate this lineup. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, so we got Daniel Berger. We got. Ke uh, Kevin Strillman, Kevin Kisner, a couple Kevins in there, Andrew Putnam, JJ Spawn, and Mark Hubbard. That is your two minute men lineup build for draft. This thing is going to be, this thing is going to win all the money or it's going to be in last place. And Spaz, Spaz Bite challenged us to build one without Maverick McNeely, and we, we successfully did that, which is yeah. tough. I didn't even say his name in that whole thing. That was, good. I was going to, but, um, yeah. 